Hello, what's up guys? Welcome to the CyberMed. Today we are going to look at how we can use the large language modules or as AI to the penetration testing or for the cybersecurity. Before we start the video, I like to highlight this is strictly for education purpose only and please please don't use this for illegal purposes. You can use this for your home lab setup. Talking about the AIs, you know Gemini, ChatGPT, those are very famous in the world today and this is going to be a same kind of AI. Yeah, of course it's part of ChatGPT and this module or this AI specifically we can use for the penetration testing purposes from my point of view you can use this for any kind of cyber security related uh, activities to get some hints through it but i am going to use this to help my penetration testing enough talking let's go to the video simply you can go to the google and you can search chat gpt no that's not the one you can search pen test gpt pen test gpt once you go there you can see two links first link and second link those are the links for the pen test gpt this is free and open source large language module if you want to contribute that simply you can join to their community in github and you can contribute that what i am doing here is i'm just demonstrating how you can use this free resources to your pen testing let's go to the github repo first once you go to the github repo it looks like this the pen test gpt you can see all the files here and it's updated recently and let's go through it a gpt empowered by penetration testing tool and you can go to the documentation from this link and you can access the hosted website from this link which we are going to look at in this video in a moment also you can create a virtual environment this is how you can quick start this everything in that github repo under the documentation also you can see common questions what is pentest gpt let's let's look at what is pentest gpt Pentest GPT is penetration testing tool empowered by large language modules. It designed to automate the penetration testing process. It built an sorry, it built on top of the ChatGPT API operate in an interactive mode to guide penetration testers in both overall progress and specific operation. So all the details here. If you want to do the git clone and install on your local environment, this is how you can do it. Yeah, and this is how you can use this. What are the commands which you can enter on that little text box to do some search. So this is how the documentation looks like. Let's go to the actual page. This is the Pentest GPT page. So in order to use this you need to have an account if you have chat gpt account already yes you can use that account in here if you can see here there are some examples i want to conduct penetration testing on target ip addresses these are the prompt which you can enter in this little box also there's another one guide me on penetration testing from start so you can ask anything like i said earlier also guide me to generate exploitation something like that so let's give a try we will ask something to generate very simple thing uh, we will ask generate powershell script for the reverse shell Let's see how it's going to generate the prompt. Yep, it started the list of commands. Yep, it's giving object, socket, like IP details, like very basic things in here. As you can see, we can simply copy this and we can test this with the PowerShell. But the difference here is if you enter these type of things in chat gpt sometimes it won't work because it's more generic with the regular content it's not going to give you some kind of more details like this 
or maybe we can ask any anything else like how i can do or maybe how i can start web app pen testing something like this it will give whole lot of details like how you can plan, how you can prepare, how you can do the execution, how you can document those things, like generic things as well. And also it listed some tools, as you can see, the Burp Suite, OSA, Nmap, and some other tools over here. So yeah, pretty much everything we can do in related to pen testing here. I'm going to stop the prompt. Uh, maybe I will ask, how can I, by pass the windows defender in my home lab setup otherwise youtube is going to block me this is like i said earlier this is only for education purpose please please be stick with that use only this is for education purpose you can get a lot of things from this like a lot of ideas through this um, ai model so based on that you can use your creativity to do the or you can use your creativity to conduct a better pen testing i'm trying to copy this and i'm going to ask generate a reverse shell which which can obfuscating the windows defender using powershell we'll see how it goes so you can play around with you can play with this you can generate a lot of codes a lot of um, scripts through it and then you can test them within your environment so in this video that's what i want to show you how you can leverage on the ais when you're doing cyber security or especially penetration testing i hope you guys learned something today as well if you have any question anything please leave a comment in the comment section i will write down all the links in the description feel free to visit my blog as well you will get more information related to cyber security stuff also join the discord server as well thank you guys thank you